Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Bigby West, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make the second version of a duct tape phone case. So this one, you can also add some card pockets on the side, and you can use it, and let's get into it. So first you need a pair of scissors, an X-Acto knife with a nice sharp edge, um, two or one rolls of duct tape, it's up to you, and some clear tape. So first you're going to take the measurements of your phone. Mine is about three inches wide and then half an inch thick. So then you're going to take your first color of duct tape and you're going to go ahead and lay down a strip. And you're going to make sure that your phone can be flipped over onto it. So that is including that edge. So um, then you're just going to go ahead and cut it out. And mine was about a total of seven inches. And then you want to take your second color of tape and go ahead and go over it halfway down and you want to take the top little piece and flip it over just like this then you're going to turn it over and get another piece of your other color tape and just keep working your way down um you just kind of keep layering it down just like that and then once you're sure that your phone will you know be able to fit in it because we're going to fold this over um you're just going to finish it off and then cut any of the excess tape and then you're going to make sure that it can fold over easily just like this. So then you're going to take some clear tape. And if you guys can't see it, it's right there. And then you're just going to take another piece and layer it down about halfway down. Take the top piece and lay it over so there is no stickiness on the top. And the bad thing about clear tape is you can kind of see the bubbles, but that's okay. You can also use a plastic bag if you'd like. Then, just like before, we're going to keep layering pieces of clear tape until you can cover all of your phone and a little bit more. So then you're going to take your phone and make sure that the clear tape will easily cover both sides and then you're going to finish off that clear tape like canvas almost and then you're going to cut any extra and once again go ahead and make sure that it'll fit nice um because you know you want it to be tight but not too tight then you're going to take a piece of tape um and then you're just going to go ahead and put it on the side of the clear tape and then you're just going to basically tape it onto the canvas we made earlier um, and then I had a little too much tape, so I had to go ahead and cut some of the extra on the sides. And then I just had to cover it up later, but that's okay. And then I went ahead and I put my phone inside and then laid the piece of clear tape over it. And then I went ahead and took another piece of the regular zebra and I just went ahead and taped it down just like that. And you want to make sure that that clear tape does fit well so then we want to just go ahead and make sure it fits and then you're going to put your case back in or your phone i'm just using my case because i'm recording with my phone and then you're going to this is the tricky part but you're going to take a pair of scissors and you're going to cut two little slits right where like the edge of your phone is if you know what i mean um, it's kind of hard to explain but just kind of watch the video and you're going to take a small piece of clear tape and then just kind of bend that like inwards and down at the same time. If you know what I mean, I don't know, it's kind of hard to explain. And then you're just gonna do that on both sides. So then you're just going to take one more piece of clear tape and you're going to go ahead and tape that biggest piece down and you're probably going to have to go around to the front. And 
that's basically it. If you want, you can add a strap like I did, and you can even put some credit card holders on the side, but that's basically it. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys found this tutorial helpful, and if you did, please do give this video a like, and consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!